Hello friends, so today we are going to discuss this question on lead code problem number 60 permutation sequence. The question statement states that you are given a set of numbers uh, consisting of numbers from 1 to n and which is a total give you of n factorial unique permutations. I hope you know permutations. If you don't know, you can watch my previous lecture on permutation and combination where I teach all the concepts related to permutations. On next permutation, finding the kth permutation, you can go and watch it. Uh, the, the same question is the question here I'm teaching is almost same but it is a question on lead code that's why I'm telling you so the question statement says that by listing for n equal to 3 these are the 6 because 3 factorial is equal to 6 so these are the 6, fact, six uh, permutations for the number 1 to 3 so you are given kth value and you have to find the kth permutation of the sequence so you can directly find kth permutation using like some logical reasoning uh, which I have also told in the previous lecture you can go and watch it but here in this question I have just used a predefined STL of C++ you can also use this uh, you can also use any other method so in this way first I defined a vector array vector array to store all the numbers from 1 to n okay so here here I'm like filling the array now I am moving the for loop from 1 to k and finding the next permutation for this sequence because in this array I stored the number from 1 to n and because n is small from 1 to 9 so I have made an array and put all the numbers from 1 to n in this and then I find the next permutation. This is a STL in C++ which is used to find the next permutation. But as the return is in string, so then I made an empty string. And uh, what I'll do is I iterate over the final permutated array, and uh, then I convert the uh, the number to string. You can also use a predefined function here also to convert the number into string uh, like there's the, 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 the predefined function is uh, string to integer stoi uh, sorry that is used to convert string into integer but here we have to convert to string so the function can be used to string to string function can be used to convert the number to string but I have used this type of uh, for loop and then, all, then only you have to just return the final string return the final permutated value permutation sequence that's it the code is guys pretty simple here and uh, it is running perfectly fine mm. yeah it's running perfectly fine if you want to see how this next permutation function is working inside you can go and watch my video uh, i have also shown how the code works uh, thank you for watching this video if you have any doubts please mention it in the comment box i will try to rectify it as soon as possible thank you for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one